So you're thinking about moving right here to Prosper, Texas. Well, today I'm going to be covering some of the top neighborhoods in Prosper, Texas. Now, don't get mad at me because we're going to cover some that might be in Salina as well, but they're all going to be in Prosper ISD. So when people are making a move, most of the time they are families and the school district is the most important thing. So they really don't care which city it lies in because if you know anything about the Dallas area, especially the North Dallas area, they share school districts with multiple locations. So Salina, Prosper ISD crosses over quite a bit. So I'm gonna be covering the top five communities that I get requested the most often and they're some of my favorites. Some have some new construction, some a little bit older, but they're all gonna have a wide variety of price ranges and amenities so i hope you get a lot of value from this video i know there's lots of choices out there so hopefully this helps you narrow that down a little bit and maybe i can help you find the perfect house in one of these locations so i hope you stick around because we're getting after it right now First up on our list is going to be the absolutely gorgeous neighborhood of Gentle Creek. This neighborhood is going to be a little bit different than your typical master plan community. It's going to be on large half acre to one acre lots with a championship golf course, lots of beautiful rolling hills and custom homes. Creek Estates is an upscale community nestled around the Gentle Creek Golf Club in Prosper, Texas. This community spans 630 acres and features luxurious and modern single family homes with golf course views as well as top notch amenities surrounded by natural woods and lakes. Gentle Creek Estates is also near the Dallas North Tollway and US 380, allowing residents to easily travel to Dallas and Frisco for additional big city entertainment and attractions. These homes are gonna be anywhere from around the 800s to well over the million dollar mark. These homes started around 2004 and were built out around the 2016 timeframe. They're gonna range anywhere from around 3,000 square feet up to over 5,000 square feet in size. The private golf club that surrounds the neighborhood is 235 acres of manicured fairway and wooded countryside. Carved into the gently rolling terrain, the golf course offers an immensely pleasurable game for the average golfer with enough tee selections and length to challenge the more skilled players. The course features intriguing elevation changes, picturesque water features, including a spectacular 22-acre lake. Next up on the list is the very popular neighborhood of Light Farms. Now, Light Farms is gonna be mainly in Salina, Texas, but you're gonna be in Prosper ISD and it does cover part of Prosper. So it's one of the favorites on the list because it's one of the most requested neighborhoods due to all the different types of builders, price points, and amenities that Light Farms provides. It is one of the best family friendly neighborhoods in all of North Texas and for good reason. This neighborhood provides 13 plus miles of hiking and bike trails, as well as many outdoor activities. A place called The Barn with an amphitheater for multiple concerts throughout the years. And you're also gonna have 200 plus events scheduled by the neighborhood staff. Your family and friends will always be getting together for multiple different occasions and never get bored. You're also gonna have 240 plus acres of green space 
playgrounds, community lawns, and things to do of that sort. You're also going to find five pools in this neighborhood. Not one, not two, but five different pools, including a junior Olympic pool for your kids. This neighborhood's also going to have a fitness center with yoga classes and strength training classes. And they have a place called The Nook. So you can eat breakfast or lunch in that area as well as have some delicious craft beers. They've also got a tennis complex with three different courts. So if tennis is your thing, it's a great option for you as well. Currently, like I said, the homes are 500,000s all the way up to well over a million dollars. And they're usually gonna be on the 50 to 60 wide lots. You're gonna have tons of builders to choose from, from the affordable type like MI Homes and KHOV to the more expensive ones of American Legendaries, Toll Brothers, Shattuck, and Tradition Homes. Next on the list is the very popular Liliana. Here you can plan a picnic with your neighbors at Liliana's outdoor kitchen and pavilion or go for a swim and cool off in the luxury pool. Closest to the entry, you'll find the community catch and release pond. Liliana's newest amenities, Blue Bonnet Park, features the covered pavilion, picnic tables, cornhole, sports courts, gas grills, and children's play area. They're on phase five as of the making of this video, which they're adding a resort style pool with sunbathing and lounging, activity lawn, extended walking and hiking and bike trails, splash pad, playground, and pavilions with a restroom. Of course, this is an A plus rated Prosper ISD with many different builders to choose from, ranging from the starting prices of the 400s to around the 800,000s. The builders in this community are gonna be American Legend, Bloomfield, Highland Homes, and MI Homes. Next up is the beautiful community of Star Trail. I recently did a video on this absolutely stunning community that I said competes with Winsong Ranch. A host of exclusive private amenities await you at Star Trail. Serene lakes and beautiful fountains greet you upon your arrival. Miles of trails begin for hiking and biking throughout the community. As you continue down Star Trail's winding tree-lined entrance, you'll find the community center and amenity area. This five-acre haven is reserved exclusively for Star Trail residents and includes a community clubhouse with a party room, extended outdoor lounge areas and fireplace with a big screen TV, three resort-style pools, a stunning pool and leisure pool and a children's pool, two party pavilions, complete with grills and outdoor dining tables, one acre children's playground with covered picnic pavilion, two lighted tennis courts, and on-site Prosper ISD Elementary, Joyce Hall Elementary. Now this neighborhood is gonna be on the higher end. You're gonna be anywhere from around the six, seven hundred thousands for the smaller lots. And some of the builders include American Legend, Britain Homes, Highland Homes, and Toll Brothers. And the final and most popular neighborhood of all, of course, is gonna be Winsong Ranch. <music> when 
Tucson Ranch is known for its five acre tropical paradise with crystal clear water lagoon, but it's just one of the many things to love about the community. Residents also enjoy resort style swimming pools, a sports court complex with tennis, pickleball, and basketball, amazing fitness facilities, kids playgrounds, an amphitheater, a mountain biking course, a dog park, a community garden, an 18 hole championship disc golf course, beautiful parks and miles of winding and hike and bike trails. Residents also love the full calendar of events brought to you by the award-winning full-time lifestyle department. You can get into Winsong Ranch with in a townhome for somewhere in around the 400s to 500 thousands. Or if you wanted to build a single family home or purchase a resale home, you're gonna be looking anywhere from around the 800 thousands to well over the million dollar mark, depending on the builder. You're gonna have anything from about 50 wide lots up to 80 to even, I've heard it coming soon, 100 foot wide lots. Some of the builders to choose from would be American Legend, Highland, Trophy, Drees, Tradition, Coventry, Shattuck, Southgate, and Belclair Homes, to name a few. Well, that concludes today's video. I hope you got some value from it. And remember, I have videos on tons of neighborhoods around Prosper, in Prosper, as well as different cities. If you're looking for resale or new construction, I can probably find it for you and I'd love to help you out. So make sure you check out those other videos. If you have any suggestions for new videos you'd like to see of neighborhoods or city vlogs, I would love to hear your feedback, but make sure to give me a call, shoot me a text or send me an email. I'd love to be your agent of choice and I hope to see you around town.